Finally, Nakauka Road project construction resumes. Let's find out more details. So these houses you see by the roadside that are marked with X are going to be demolished to allow construction of the road. Houses like this one. I want to have a so what you just saw there <laughs> is uh, actually that part had taken long without any work going on so these guys have i think they have resumed with uh, they have resumed with their work yeah so that part had even got some bush around but now they are using tractors to level that section to widen the section this is one of the trucks fetching the, the soil they, are, they, they have resumed with the work you see of late they, they had stopped working i don't know why they stopped I don't know, but now they have resumed completely. So guys, this is a section of the Nakauka Road and this way I'm coming from Sisa Town, that small town you see up there and I want to take you as we see the progress of the construction of the Nakauka Road project. This is a swamp just after Sisa. At this section, you can see that the road is wide enough. They have managed to clearly demarcate where the road will be passing. But so vehicles passing here will not struggle anymore. It's going to be a four lane, I guess. The road will be passing at that section. This is going to be like uh, <laughs> the culvert. Yeah. To allow proper drainage at this section. So that's the culvert. The stones have just been put here of recent because they look newer. You can notice that this drainage channel is, uh, has been well installed here and of recent not walk properly at this section because they were constructing this drainage channel. So the drainage channel is already installed under and the water is crossing from this side of the swamp to this other side of the swamp. Places with the uh, swamps give hard time to these guys constructing roads. So they spend a lot of time actually this is the section that they have spent a lot of time since this uh, construction began and now i think since they are done with this section other parts are going to be very much so that's where we come in the just look at the progress
guys, do you know that this project uh, looks to have delayed so much? I don't know why it's taking too long. Because, yeah? I don't know. But we have seen some government officials inspecting maybe the construction has begun again. So by the, by the last time I was here, this wasn't complete. This is some good progress. Yeah. I want to get your comments in the comment section. What you really think about this road progress and why you think it is delaying? Why do you think Ugandan road projects delay a lot? Despite the fact that the government invests the money, gives them the money, but I don't know what what's the cause of the delay so actually here there was a uh, it wasn't well leveled like you can see it wasn't straight and it is now straightened at this point do you think that some people intended to delay the the, the construction of this world project so that they can get some car money you know <laughs> this thing of giving builders work like to build for you your house and they will tell you that the project is going to take like two months and it will be complete you will get your full house in two months then you see that these guys are extending to even four months such that they can get some car money they can rip some good car money out of you i think it is the same case here these guys are trying to delay this road project so that they can rip some good car money for themselves but let's go ahead and see what what's there some good progress at this point. They have even just compressed. Laban, you see there, actually, in the cow but is a drainage channel. You see? Ahead of us, there is something I want to show you guys. Look, let me show you. 